Now, for the cross product, one of the property of it is two vectors that is multiplied. Okay, using the cross product, the answer is equal to another vector which is C. And unlike in a scalar vector, if we will multiply two vectors using a dot product, the answer is a scalar or a magnitude only. Well, here, this one, if we will multiply A cross B, the answer is C. And we have to note that in cross product, if we will multiply two vectors and they should be perpendicular to each other. If I have here my vector A and this is my vector B. Okay, so that is vector A and vector B and their orientation is perpendicular. So let's say that is 90 vector C. Okay. The product of these two vector is perpendicular to the plane of A and B. So, this will be the direction of our vector C. Vector C is in this direction. So, if our vector A is in high, uh, I hat, if our vector B is in J hat, so therefore, our vector C is in K hat. Okay. So, we have to note that if two vectors are cross multiplied in the same direction with the other vector the answer is zero so i cross i is equal to zero j cross j is also equal to zero k cross k is also equal to zero if we will multiply i so for example this one i cross j so the answer is positive k but if we will have this one j cross i if we will multiply them the answer would be negative k so the answer will not be the same but they are opposite we will use the right hand rule so if this is my palm this one the thumb will be pointing to the first vector the four fingers will be pointing for the second vector and the palm will point to the answer of our last vector. So, let's try it. So, for example, this is I. I on an X times B, which is on the negative J. So, your palm is going outward. So, that is Z. Okay? Or K hat. So, that is I cross J is equal to K. If we will have the opposite. So, the first vector now is R going up. And our second vector is on positive i. So, that will be the position. So, the palm is facing on the paper. So, this is first vector, j, second vector, i. And the palm is facing inward the paper. So, that is negative k. What if now I have k cross i? So, I assume if since this is in k, direction and this is i my answer is either positive j or negative j so here first vector is outward since that is k then my second vector is on i so let's assume that is lying out here so this is outward and then i so my palm is going up so the answer is positive j okay and if it's k cross j so that is k again going out and this time our j should be on positive j so my palm is facing in this direction which is facing to the left that is negative i so please try the other combination of the product of this vector so let's try to solve the product of vectors from our previous problem again so we have here a is equal to okay so if we will multiply a cross b we will have 38 0.37 i hat 
plus 61.40 J hat. Okay, that is Newton. Cross it to negative 46.36 I hat minus 33.68 J hat. Newton. And here, we will just multiply two directions that are different to each other. So, I cross I is 0. So, we will multiply this one first. So, that will be, so that is negative 1292.30. Okay, so that is I cross J that is K. So, the other one. So, we will just compute this one. So, that will be negative 2846.50. So, that is J cross I. Okay. That is negative K. So, the direction of this is negative K. And if this is negative, negative. So, positive. So, that is negative 1292. 0.30 plus 2846.50. The answer now is of A cross B is equal to positive because this will be positive 1554.2 and that is K hat. This is now the answer for this, for our previous given. So, if you will look on this, we will have the general form for A cross B. So, that will be A X I hat plus A Y J hat. If there is a Z, A Z K hat cross and that will be A b x i hat plus b y j hat plus b z k hat okay so again we will just multiply two vectors that are different in direction so this is i so i will just multiply it to this one j and this okay so so that will be a a X B Y and that is I cross J that is K that is K hat then the next one plus A X to B Z so that is I cross J uh, so A X uh, so that is I cross this is K so that is down so that is negative J and next one this vector that will be BX and this one plus AY AY BX and that is J cross I that is negative K negative k next one is plus a y then b z that is j cross k that is i hat and lastly this one multiply here and to j so that will be plus a z bx that is k times i that is j hat next is plus az times by so a times so that is negative i okay so let's simplify so this is i and this is i so you can see here so that is i and i so i will have here first is i so that is 
A, Y, B, Z. So this will be minus A, Z, B, Y, and that is I hat. And for J, so this one is J. So that is plus A, Z, B, X, minus, is this B, Z, sorry. So that is A, X, B, Z. So that is J minus this one. So that is J hat. And lastly, that will be for my Z, for my K, so that is plus AX, BY, minus AY, BX, K hat. Okay, so that is A cross B, the general form. Okay, so actually, this can also be simplified more if you are familiar with determinants in which this is A cross B is just equal to so this is i this are j and this are k okay so that is i j k and this is a x b uh, a x a y a z so sorry for that that is a this is b x b y b z so what you're just going to do you have to cover this so that will be so that will be a y b z a y times b z so that will be a y b z so that is cross multiply minus a z b y i hat which is the same with what we do here so next one is i have to cover this one okay so i will just simplify this one set the second term so instead of that so that i can so if this is will be the second term that will be a z b x and a a x b z okay so that will be just but it will be also the same if if i will have a x if i will change the position of this if I will change the position of this, this will become negative. So that is minus. So, so that is AX BZ still minus. Okay. Because I just changed the position of that. So if I have negative of this, it will be this is negative. This will become positive. So that is AX BZ minus AZ bx and that is j hat and that will be plus plus i have to cover this one that is ax by minus az uh, ay bx and that is k hat okay so it will be easy if you know this determinant formula. Okay, so let's have an example. So, for example, my vector A is equal to negative 2 i hat minus 3 j hat plus 2 k hat. And my vector B is equal to i hat plus 2 j hat minus 3 k hat and let's assume this is in meters both of these is in 
meters and this is also in meters now let's find so let's find the product so that will be a cross b is equal to this is i this is j and this is k this is negative 2 negative 3 and 2 and this one is i is just 1 2 and negative 3 okay so that will be so negative 3 times negative 3 minus 2 times 2 and that is i hat okay so again so that is negative 3 times negative 3 minus 2 times 2 i hat to simplify so negative 3 times negative 3 that is 9 minus 4 i hat so it will just be 9 minus 4 is just equal to 5 i hat next one so this is minus so again minus so here negative 2 times negative 3 still minus 2 times 1 j hat so that will be minus what will be that one negative 2 times negative 3 negative 6 minus 2 j hat so that is negative 6 minus 2 that is negative 8 minus so that is plus 8 j hat and plus 4k cover this one so that is negative 2 times 2 minus negative 3 times 1 k hat so let's simplify so plus negative 2 times 2 that is negative 4 negative 3 times 1 that is negative 3 then this is negative so plus 3 k hat and that is negative 4 plus 3 that is negative 1 k hat or negative k hat and this is now your a cross b So, this is how to get the product of vectors using determinants.